For everybody that's out there listening to OG Percy videos, man, it's some cackling came forward and said, man, everything OG Percy said, man, it's cap, man. All them Ferguson stories, man, them things are untrue, man. And they was like, in 2007, you know, it wasn't even gangster like that, man. The timeline don't add up, you know what I'm saying? All the real killing and stuff was going on in the 80s, in the early 90s. So you come into Ferguson 2007, man, it wasn't none of that, man. White boys was getting protection and stuff like that. Well, no rapes going on, people getting shanked up, and people getting, you know, their trays took, and they canteen ate up by goons and stuff like that, man. It was all control movement. Like, you couldn't even go nowhere without the police right there, man. So, they were like, OG Percy, capping and stuff, man. But I ain't making this up. This is another nigga from around the way that was at Ferguson with him, and he tired of watching it on YouTube, man, because he like, this cat a clown. He would have been old anyways at the time he said he was at Ferguson doing all this, and, you know, all that stuff he was talking about, it just didn't happen, man. Cat living in fantasy land, talking about all these war daddy stories to try to scare the young cat straight, like he should be on scared straight or something. And you know he's lying, but let me play y'all a clip. Tough niggas. You hear what I'm saying, Hollywood? Yeah, that motherfucking, <laughs> that motherfucking circus shit. I get it. It's the circus, right? And, and the yeah, circus yeah. is clowns. But it's lines too, nigga. This, this the lines act. The lines that showed up, nigga. OG Percy, a mark that ain't that ain't took care of nothing, that ain't done nothing. And that's lying about his reputation in prison. And he lying about his reputation on the street. That nigga burger of habitation, domestic violence nigga. That nigga ain't done no gangster shit in his life. Do you hear what I'm saying? When it was time to get gangster, he was preaching and crying and smoking crack. He ain't no gangster. So I just want to represent that because for people like us that really survived that shit and went through that shit and made something out of it, to see him on the internet praising that shit and getting claps and our nigga doing all them interviews. This nigga, man, I look at that shit. I got to get my fucking disinfectant and spray my phone. The whole, the whole video look like it's happened. So when they told Percy what happened, Percy said, Percy said, Percy said, uh, um, <laughs> delete that nigga. Hey, Percy, um, Percy set out a, a, a situation saying whoever carried out the violation, if they come over to the building, they gonna get smashed. You know what I'm saying? So, nigga, it was a big light-skinned nigga named Rude Boy. This is a big light-skinned nigga named Rude Boy. Look like, man, big motherfucker. So I stood next to Rude Boy because I'm a calm, cool, collective nigga. So I'm telling I said, man, who the fuck is Percy? Mm. And on Ferguson Chronicles, and you say we gonna tell the truth, right? Man, this nigga yeah, OG Percy, OG Percy was not on Ferguson when it was rocking and rolling. When it was Gladiator Unit, he was not there.